Podcast. And welcome back to your news at five. We're taking a live look at our Snoopy's cam here. You can see some blue skies out there, and it's looking still pretty hot out there. We're still dealing with those temperatures within the triple digits as we go throughout the rest of this uh, past couple days as we look ahead into next week as well. Still contending with that. But uh, we have some hope ahead in the forecast. But I'll get into that in just a few moments here. Uh, all over the coastal bend, we're going to take a look at our current temperatures and feels like all over here. Uh, Corpus Christi, we're feeling like a 112, even though our air temperature is at 98 degrees there. Kingsville, you're not feeling too much better there with your air temperature at 99 but feels like 112 and NAS Corpus Christi over to the bluff you guys are at 94 degrees but feels like 113 out there so all over the coastal bend as I said we're still contending with that heat so we do have some heat alerts in effect for today they began at 12 and will continue all the way until 8 p.m. here all of the areas there here shaded in pink that means you're under an excessive heat warning so this includes uh, San Patricio, Nueces as well as Clayburg and Jim Wells counties there so those are going to be the areas that are feeling the most intense heat as we go throughout the rest of this afternoon and into the evening hours until this expires here and the airs are shaded in orange here. That means you're under a heat advisory. But all over the coastal bend will still have those feel like temperatures as we just saw range between 110 all the way up to 120 degrees. So still intense heat out there. You want to make sure you're still practicing your heat safety tips and make sure you're staying safe out there as we go throughout the rest of this, uh, the, the rest of today for the next couple hours until those do expire. Now, as we know, we haven't had any rain in the forecast for a minute now all over the month of August. We have yet to see any rain. And of course, this is putting us in some dire straits as we take a look at our drought monitor here all over the coastal bend at this point. We're dealing with a moderate or severe drought at this point as a result of the lack of rain that we've gotten in the forecast. Falfutius Ferry is a smidgen better, just abnormally dry for this time of year. But all over the coastal bend, we are just aching for that rain. We have yet to get any rain in the forecast. And this is a small glimmer of hope that we're looking forward to here. So Tuesday and Wednesday, we could possibly see a shower, a couple stray showers making their way to the coastal bend here. But mostly showers will be hanging out in the Gulf. So hopefully a good sea breeze can help bring these showers in and hopefully more in Inland communities can get a couple showers coming into the forecast because this is desperately needed as I as we just saw with the drought like conditions as we're still dealing with all over the coastal bench so even just a little bit of rain is better than nothing so for tonight we're going to have some mostly clear conditions out there still be pretty breezy as we get into later hours of tonight as well but we will have a low temperature there of 80 degrees for tonight but once we look ahead and tomorrow we're going to be back in the copy and paste of that intense heat looking at our high temperatures for tomorrow so Corpus Christi will be sitting at 100 degrees there Kingsville one, uh, 103 degrees there and Alice of course being at 105 there so all over the coastal bend we'll still be dealing with that intense heat and once we look ahead for those uh, uh, heat index values so what it's going to feel like out there we'll be back in that range of needing those heat advisories and possibly excessive heat warnings for the next couple days there as we look ahead into tomorrow but for your seven day forecast here we're still dealing with those temperatures in the triple digits but holding out hope for those stray showers for your Tuesday and Wednesday but that's a fearful forecast stay with us